Hi Taurus, welcome to your love reading, how are you? In this reading I will be looking at your current energies, the person in your mind, other important details, and if you are interested or looking for a new person, there's this uh, spread at the end where I will be looking at the energies of the next new person coming in. If you're new to the channel, welcome as well, and I invite you to subscribe because I post daily. Okay, let's begin. Let's shuffle five times for your reading. Two more shuffles. What are the energies around you? I think... I'm getting this uh, energy from your person that you are still interested about or thinking about. They are acting cold. They are very detached. Angry and upset with you. Resistant to open up. But they still want you. They still want to celebrate the love with you. It's quite interesting. I think they feel hurt or this person contemplates a lot contemplates a lot about how it ended. It was a third party situation or a very painful, hurtful ending, and they think it has not healed yet. What is affecting you in your subconscious? That you still have desire or maybe think and believe this can be manifested or this can have some progress. The attraction might not have diminished that much. What was the main challenge? I think they might have had options and they were not quite 100% uh, focus into you or this person was very indecisive. So you did see a person that was not fully wanting or convinced to, to invest into that connection. Now, you don't want to send a message to them and get rejected or not to get a reply back or just to get a very formal, friendly reply. And you hope that your love life will have more progress, not stagnancy. And if you have been thinking about the past person, you want to see at least some sign of progress. Now, before jumping to the new person, let's first see the person that is currently in your mind. What are their current energies towards you? Let's see about them. They're not talking, apparently. There's some blockage of communication. Maybe there was some real blockage in the past and that's why they don't talk. Or maybe there's this distance. If it was a distance relationship, if it was the case. Now, this person wants to build something solid, wants a new stable beginning. They're acting cold. They're mostly focusing on themselves and they're not talking right now. Either because the uh, communication was not the best or they reflect upon the distance, the long distance that might uh, be a roadblock. Okay, now what is on their mind? They feel rejected by you. They feel left out in the cold, like you don't have any more love for them. Do, you, do they have any plans of actions? Yes, they are looking for something serious. They are not looking for anything casual. What is in their subconscious? This person wants to heal from this and still they are affected by that deep space created between you both. Do they have any plans of action? Yes, they want to offer you a new love story, a new beginning. They want you, it's quite obvious here, but uh, apparently, logically, they don't think this is going to work or they analyze too much how it ended and that's why there's this blockage to them. What is the possible outcome in the near future? I don't see you both opening up. If we continue in the same timeline, you both will be guarded. And again, you both cannot forgive each other about what happened or particular aspects of the relationship. And that is why there's this blockage. So this person wants to communicate, they want to express some feelings, a new beginning, and they're looking for something long term and commitment, but they're not doing much. They are just uh, contemplating uh, how they might have not 
another chance to give this a shot and opportunity to make this better or you both to try again they want to communicate definitely something they want to say sorry about something as well they do have desire and they want to make things right but i don't see actions happening here by none of you in the near future if we are always in the same timeline if timelines don't change now if you want to know even more details about this person that is currently in your mind there's an extended video as well in the description box below with even more details about their current energies and some of your energies as well okay now let's continue with the new person what is the energy of the next new person coming in if you're looking for a new person it will not be very comfortable reaching out with them or communicating they have trust issues they are coming into this new connection with uh, not much security about being in a relationship yes very very guarded and it will not help you become vulnerable towards them as well but what you may not see exactly but you may reflect you may meditate and come to this conclusion that they are attracted towards you the the fact that they respond to you quickly uh, the fact that uh, they approve any proposal you may have to go out on dates or uh, try different things to get to know each other more it proves that they are interested now what will be their first impression about you they will see a soulmate connection they will see you as a potential best friend and as a potential lover at the same time they see a deep connection there but why are they so guarded they are moving uh they are probably just moving away from a very important connection in their love life and that's why they haven't had time to heal completely from that story what will be your first impression about them yes you will definitely notice a person that is grieving or in sorrow and disappointment about a past love story they have not moved on emotionally energetically from a past relationship it is very clear like uh, a cloud without cloud uh, a sky i meant a sky without clouds it's that kind of clear to you that this person has some processing to do to heal completely uh, what is the possible energy the first month of the interaction i don't see you jumping into an official relationship immediately it might take some time in the beginning for you to fully understand or uh, accept to each other that now we are dating now we are going out on dates and we are we are interested into each other so it's kind of slow process here and uh, just be careful that this is not a missed opportunity this might be a missed opportunity for this person if they are so guarded so this is an advice for you indirectly if you want this connection i think you just need to understand more uh, of this person uh, what are their motives about uh, acting like that and maybe being a bit more patient to give more time uh, to them to accommodate with uh, the new love story Taurus this was your general reading I hope this was helpful if you liked and resonated with this reading please hit the like button and share the video if you want to it helps a lot the channel and I highly appreciate it also, if you haven't subscribed already, I invite you to subscribe because I post daily. You can check the schedule in the description box below this video. Wishing you all the best. I, um, I wish you a great day and I will see you in, at the next reading. Bye for now.